Morning, Josh from SMC. I'm going to show you how to change the mode on a Multistrada V4S. Let's come and have a look. So we want to start off. This is your dash. And we're going to be using two buttons today. This tog here and the mode button here. We're going to set up uh, sport mode. We're currently in touring mode, as you can see. And we're going to change the settings in sport mode. We're going to do that together. So the first thing you need to do on your main menu, just up here, is you're going to go to setting menu, click into that, and it'll come up with riding mode. You're going to use this tog down here on your left to click into that and we're going to choose sport mode so once we go up into sport mode you can see that there's several different settings we'll start off in engine so on engine you've got two choices for full power or reduced power with a smooth delivery or with a dynamic delivery you can have high medium or low high will give you full power with a dynamic delivery medium will give you that full power but it'll be a smoother delivery whereas low will give you a reduced power with a smoother delivery but because we're in sport mode we're going to go up to high so let's click it into there and you'll see over on the right hand side just here that'll show you what screen you're in you're in so we click back to the left and let's choose our traction control settings so you've got three options and eight settings to do so wet road and off-road with a more performance leaning control or safe and stable but we're going to have it nice down the middle maybe leaning more towards performance on the road. So let's stick it in three, go back to our settings, and let's start choosing our ABS. So with our ABS, again, you've got three settings with off-road or road, safe and stable, or performance. But because we're in sport mode, we want to keep it in two. In fact, maybe let's put it, let's keep it in two rather than in one where you get the front only. So then we go to our wheelie control. You can have it off completely if you're a complete nutcase. However, if you're not and you want that front wheel to stay on the floor, you can have it all the way up into eight, which means the computer is going to keep the front wheel on the floor as much as you can. But we want a nice little mixture, so we're going to go level four. So the front wheel can come up if you want, but only if you really want it to. Quick shifter, nice and easy. Quick shifter is either on or it's off, but it's up and down in every gear. And then moving on to our suspension. Now, this is where things get quite a trick. So you can set your settings of your, of your front forks. So you've got five settings, hardest, hard, medium, soft, and softest. But because we're in sport mode, we want it quite a hard setting. Not too hard. So we'll, not, we'll leave hardest, we'll just stick with hard, click it into there. Go back and we'll set up our rear shock. So we click down, go into rear. Again, five settings. We want the front to match the rear. So let's keep that in hard. You go back, click your left button, and now we can set your preload. So here, you've got five settings. So you've got the first one here, which is just if it's yourself as the rider. We click down, you've got the rider and your luggage. Third one is rider and pillion. The fourth is rider, pillion, and luggage. So being as you're in sport mode, let's set it up so it's just the rider. And here you've got 24 different settings depending on how tall you are or how high or low you want your preload. You can go all the way up to 24 if you want, if you want it really high. However, if you're a short ass like me, you're going to set it all the way down to 1, which is the lowest it can go. So let's set that there. Maybe not turn the hazards on. Click back and you're in your preload there. Now... If you can't see the wood for the trees and you just want to completely take it back to its factory settings, you've got this default button here. You can click the default and it'll take you back to the factory settings. So that's our sport mode set up. We'll go back to our main menu on our main dash. And as you can see, we're still in touring mode. If you see that mode button there, if you click that mode button, it'll come up onto this screen here. And you can choose using our TOG. We're currently in touring mode. And with sport mode here, which is what we've just set up, our settings there you click sport mode it'll flash five or six times come up in the main menu there and that's it sport mode set up